Hi, my name is Maria. I'm 24 years old and this is my story. I was born in Ukraine into a Christian family, but it was like prayer and going to church was mostly about cultural traditions than about time you want to spend with Jesus. I grew up with lots of questions like, why should we go to church? What can God do for me? Why am I doing this? And the answer was always, because you have to. No one told me about their fate, about God's love or about intimacy with Jesus. I grew up with empty spot inside me and eventually it filled with misunderstanding and anger. All of the things pushed me really far away from God for many years. When I turned 22, my husband and I decided to move to Canada to run away from war and start a new life. Of course, we were happy with our decision, but the immigration process, the new country, finding jobs, all the documents, language barrier, financial struggle, the cultural difference, it all became exhausting and overwhelming. Everything was a struggle. In early December last year, I was standing one evening in the bus stop. It was dark, minus 20, and the snow was falling, and the bus was late. At the time, a young man came to this bus stop and started making a small talk. At first, I felt insecure and vulnerable, but he seemed kind, so I continued to talk to him. After some time, he asked me a strange question. If someone could do anything for you, what would you ask for? I tried to find pretty words and a smart answer, but eventually I felt compelled to share my heart and struggles of my life. He told me that he was talking about Jesus. As soon as I heard this name, I started to feel like my heart was open for something. The young man asked if he could pray for me, and I thought that meant that he would go home and do this. But when I agreed, he started to do it just right there, in the middle of the street. He prayed for me, for my husband, for our family. I sat there in a bus stop and cried. I felt like my heart was finally open and I was able to see who God is, to feel Him and to accept His love. As we spoke, I kept distance from the stranger, but as soon as he finished praying, I rushed over and hugged him. And in the same way, all of these years, I kept my distance from Jesus. But now, I have found Him. After that night, I took my first step toward Him. I bought my first Bible and I started to read it. And I started listening to worship music. My favorite song, which I began listening to every day, is praise. A few months later, I found a church and I decided to check it out. We were late and the service had already started when we went to the auditorium. When we walked in, everyone was standing and singing a song I recognized immediately. It was praise. I knew in that moment, Jesus was saying to me, welcome home. The church was oasis. In Matthew 7, verse 7, it says, keep on asking and you will receive what you ask for. Keep on seeking and you will find. Keep on knocking and the door will be opened to you. And this I have found to be absolutely true. And that's why I'm here today, to publicly declare my love for Jesus Christ through baptism.